Welcome back to another video. We're doing some scouting tonight, me, Dustin, and Luke. And we've been kind of struggling, but we did just find a little field with ducks and geese in it. It's a, it's a, t a tilled wheat field or old cornfield, it looks like. But the funny thing is, there's a cornfield right there that was just cut, and they're not landing in it. We're going to get a better view of the field while we still have lights. Number-wise in this field, uh, Luke said you glassed about maybe 250, 300 geese sitting in it, and there's some ducks flying over. And We're, we're really trying to find a, a duck feed, but, I mean, if we take a goose and a duck feed, we're, we're not going to complain about that. I like how they're sitting about 15 yards from that corn, that fresh-cut corn field, and they're sitting in a black field. That's really convenient. But uh, we have Hunter, he's uh, one of our buddies, he's scouting for us too, and we're gonna probably meet up tomorrow, and whoever finds the better feed is the one we're obviously gonna hunt. We're not sure what he's found so far. I did just get a new camera, so you guys are gonna be seeing that soon. But if you guys are not following us on Instagram, make sure you guys give us a follow. If you guys aren't subscribed, definitely make sure you smash the subscribe button and check out our website with all of our apparel. I'll have that in the link below of this video. I'll see you guys in the morning, and that's when you guys are gonna find out where we're gonna be hunting. Good morning. We uh, actually, ended up finding a different feed last night at like the very last minute. It was damn near dark and we had seen some ducks going somewhere just probably 15 minutes before dark. We got denied on uh, anyways, we got denied on uh, that other duck feed we saw. Somebody else was hunting that. So we ran up to the one we saw about 15 minutes prior, made it there, found them. Turns out uh, a relative of the guy we just talked to owned it, got permission and uh, there's a bunch of ducks and geese in that one. I think it should be good. Also, this is uh, Colin's first footage on the big camera, the new one. Gonna be playing around with that today, but I think it's gonna be sweet. Just made it to the field. Well, we, we've made it to the field. We set up. I think we're running 20 dozen dive bombs. We've got three A-frames, three mojos going out right now. We have a crosswind today, so we have the spread set up for a west wind. We're sitting on a, in the middle of a tilled cornfield from last year in a bean field. So we're gonna, we set up for a cross shoot. Uh, we didn't want to make it look too funky with us just setting up three A-frames in a tilled cornfield. Like Dustin's saying, we got a mixed feed today. We got ducks and geese. We have about 45 minutes till shooting time. We're gonna stubble up the A-frames a little better than what they are. So we're gonna get stubble and then I'll go back to you guys. So we just got the A-frames all stubbled. We got a bunch of cattails. When I say a bunch of cattails, like a, a bunch of cattails. Dustin and uh, some other guy, they're going to park the trucks and then uh, it's shooting time. So we'll get back to you guys with some action. Well, you know, came in, nobody else is gonna <laughs> shoot. Pulled the trigger, That'd felt good. Hard, you know? <laughs> First bird yeah, down, rock. we're not skunked. First two ducks of the morning. Did it right out in front. One shot, one kill from somewhere down there. Hopefully they keep doing it. Shoot him! Three more hens and two drakes, and there's a couple more ducks in the decoys you gotta pick up. We just had a, a decent little spurt of action there. Hopefully the birds are just flying later and they didn't switch feeds on us. Far over that I got right here. Coming right in your gap. No hens, right? Hey, whoa, kill him. I think we got, I don't know, two, two or three out of that, but I'm getting used to this camera. There's a lot of things I need to learn on it, so just bear with me. Hey, let's kill those.
Got a pair of gadwalls here. Another Drake Mallard. What do you got? Like a Drake, got your be. Top of the elbow, because it's, yeah. I'm pretty sure that is a Drake. Yeah, it's got fine. a yellow bill. Yellow. Got some pennies to work into us. We got two. They're working us pretty tight. And then uh, me and Luke were standing outside of the blind. I was checking out my camera, but we did drop two. We can shoot seven we pintails. Oh, we got four? Yeah. We got we got four pintails, I guess. So we can shoot uh, one pintail a person. So we can shoot seven pennies. What you think about that for this time of year? Bunch of nice white, good colors on them. Oh yeah. Yeah, I got one just like that. Basically. Yeah. <laughs> Well, we finally just got uh, some geese to come in. I think there's maybe a dozen. Five landed, and I think they shot maybe seven or eight of them. We got a lot of ducks working us. Well, not a lot. We're gonna work on what we got coming in. We just had a big push of geese probably the last 20 minutes coming off the water. Most of them were cutting short through the opening in the decoys towards the end of the decoy spread. So we're gonna take some decoys from the front and we're gonna kind of make a line or a finger off the back of the spread and run it down and the edge of the bean field and hopefully try to stop them from going through that opening between the pond and the decoys. Maybe get them a little closer to the A-frames. We just picked up and we're taking pictures, but it is super windy. So when I show you guys what we got, it's gonna be choppy. So just, just bear with it. You should have sent it in the frame a little more if you want to make the But we did end up with 11 geese and we ended with 23 ducks, 24 ducks, four pintails, two gadwalls, and the rest mallards. I think we had six drakes and the rest were hens so but i think we're gonna head back to fargo and get ready for whatever's coming for us we might go scouting tonight or we got a buddy that might have a field for us to hunt tomorrow but we're gonna be having a ton of content out for a while as uh we're done farming for a bit so we have a little bit of extra stuff we're, we're gonna go up there and do but other than that we're gonna be hunting a lot so if you guys aren't subscribed smash that subscribe button if you guys haven't checked out our website that'll be in the link below got a bunch of apparel hoodies hats t-shirts a lot of stuff so Make sure you check it out, and if you like these videos, smash the like button as well. But I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.